everybody. Okay. I'm um, doing another Timu try on. So first off are these shorts. So they're the stretchy shorts. They're in a extra large, which I think is a 12. So I was hoping they would fit. Um, they're really tight on the legs. There's, there's no pockets. Um, the waistband is about this big. So it's kind of, you know, like a suck you in kind of a shorts. Um, it's the one with the weird booty thing in there, so I can't really tell what it looks like from behind, so I don't know, but it's got this right here. It's got like a crinkly fabric. I don't know. It's very weird, but, um, but they fit fine, and the only thing I don't like is there's no pockets, which I've realized I do like pockets. So, um, the shirt I did get in an extra large. It's a little tighter than I like, but I think it'll look better with shorts instead of you know, workout shorts. Um, but I know I'm still getting used to the hair. Um, anyway, so it's beach, please. It's a nice soft fabric. This here is that, I don't know, you can hear it. Um, kind of thing. Um, but it's very soft. Um, but yeah, it's just this kind of a neck. It's the full back on it. And I am liking both of these. Like I said, I don't think I'd pair them together. I would work out with these, but I wouldn't necessarily, you know, wear them out. Um, and then the shirt I would wear out, but I think I would pair it with another pair of shorts or something that wasn't so hugging on here so that it would, uh, you know, you get this thing going on. So that thing going on should be disappearing with some more walks. So um, I have to the end of September to kind of get good for my cruise. So yeah, let's fingers crossed. So anyway, um, I am liking this. I hope you do. I love this. It's just such a beautiful design that I'm thrilled with that. So okay, let me try something else. Okay, here's the next one. So this is just the little camo, cameo, cameo, cami cami top <laughs> so um yeah it's in this nice little black and white i think it's a little well i have a black bra on and you really cannot see it through there so it's not that thin that it's see-through or anything um it's got a nice little like curves in a little here and then flares out a little more at the waist almost looks like a rounded bottom um again i wouldn't pair it with these shorts i would dress these up a little this dress up a little more um and i wouldn't wear um, a black bra under here. I would hopefully, oh, what's on my chest? Gross. Um, <laughs> I would um, either wear a strapless or I'd wear um, like a white strapped bra, which would kind of, well, actually they're both colors on there. Um, yeah, I would go with strapless if I can wear something like that or um, maybe those clear bra straps, but it's got this really pretty decoration on here. Oops, if I showed you, it'd be better. So yeah, these pretty little things. So I think it could go dressy. It's a nice back to it, fits really nice. It's an extra large, so yay. Um, it doesn't cling anywhere. It needs to be steamed a bit, but um, actually it looks kind of cute with these shorts. But um, yeah, I wouldn't feel comfortable wearing these out. I don't think, no. Anyway, it's really cute. Um, and it's more of a dressier, silkier, it's not silk by any means, but that kind of a, you know, smooth kind of feel to it, like a more dress up shirt instead of like a workout kind of a shirt. Okay, next item. So this is, yeah, thumbs up. <laughs> next one. Next. Okay, I wish I could change that fast, as fast as you're saying it, but yeah. Um, I found the pause on my camera. I'm like, there's no pause button. Nobody ever told me different. There is a pause. <laughs> Anyway, um, okay, so this is that little eyelet one. Again, it's in an extra large. Again, I would not wear it with these shorts. Um, I might try it on with the pair of pants um, that I got from Timu that are next, but we'll see. I also wouldn't wear it with the black bra because you can see through to your bra and your strap, so a white one or flesh tone would be better. Um, Okay, this is a paparazzi necklace, in case you were wondering. Um, but anyway, it's got these really pretty lace sleeves. They come down and hide some some bad area there, so my arms don't look that bad in it. Um, and then this is an eyelet 
material so you can see through those little dots um, but it fits very comfortable it's a full back nice lace around the neck very comfortable not too tight another thumbs up yay for me <laughs> all right let me get to the pants which i'm like oh, i don't know how those are gonna be i want them to be so good but we'll see okay i'll be right back okay these are the pants and if you have watched my videos at all you know why i like these it's because it's the ocean and then the sand um look to it now i rolled them up a little i like they had it in the picture um they're like um I can't even describe this material it's like a silky so it kind of looks like jeans definitely not jeans um, it's a silky material so it's probably a cool um, material for you know when I'm out and about doesn't look good on the tissue part in my opinion but I don't have much of a tissue um, it's got this little detail here on the pockets yes it does have pockets on both sides so that's kind of cute when you put your hands in your pocket I don't like it Oh, sorry, was I not even filming? Um, okay, um, so yeah, pockets right here. Nice pockets, looks cute. Um, I don't think I'd pair it with the shirt. Um, it is an elastic waist, very, very giving um, on that. So I'm not sure if I even, there's so much room in here. Hi, Miss Bella. Hi, Belle. Hello. <laughs> She's still kind of limping on that paw right there, so still can't go on our walk she's not happy but anyway um I might have been able to size down even just because I'm not not into the wide leg thing so these are uh I'm not sure kind of pants we'll have to try and put them with something else um as I get closer to my cruise that's what I really wanted them for uh was my cruise so uh as I get closer maybe I'll try and put it with something else if you have an idea what it might look good with Please put it in the comments below and help me out. I am not a fashionista by any means. Um, and so, <laughs> you know, I was an only daughter with three brothers and my mom wasn't really into fashion. And so I never really learned it. Um, my daughter is more into fashion, but not myself. But anyway, very comfortable. This does not, I mean, it's not too tight of a waistband. The elastic is about that thick in them. So that's nice. But I really liked... I, l I just like the look, the the print, okay, as, as it were. So um, I think I have one more thing to try on, so I will be right back with you. Okay, here's the last top that I have. Um, and I like this kind of a top more with these pants. So maybe, I mean, not the black, but I don't know. Let me know what you think. <laughs> Help me. Um, but yeah, I like that kind of a, you know, this is a elastic waist on here. So I can kind of fluff it up a little. And then the pants look cute. So yeah, maybe a white one, something like that. I don't know. So I'm thinking the pants might be doable. I just need to find the right top with it. Um, and I probably would even hitch them up a little more on the bottom down there. And then wear a really cute pair of sandals with them. You know, um, but we'll see. There's my little Greek Greek anklet that I bought in Greece. I think I bought it in Athens. Um, I had to walk up the stairs in this little store, and there it was, and I loved it. And so it's got great memories. Uh, anyway, this is, I thought it would be a workout top, but now that I have it on, I kind of like it that I could dress it up. I could wear it with a nice skirt or a nice pair of slacks and wear it to dinner one night. Um, I could wear it out, you know, to the show um, and dinner. I might actually wear this to, we're going to the show tonight and so I'm, and dinner, and so I might wear this top, not the pants, but the top with it. I'm not sure. Um, anyway, I like the neckline on it. It's cute. So you can put, you know, jewels or whatever here. Um, let me scan you. Please disregard the mess. That's what Bella does to my bed when she sneaks in here all day long. Um, um, and my vanity is messy, but I just want to point something out to you. So ignore everything else. But um, that's my jewelry area. So yeah, I'm a little bit of a jewelry nut. Um, that shelf was just a shelf. And then I put those little um, screw in like cup hooks all along the edge of it and then that's how I hang necklaces and then the other one I bought like that 
Um, I have a necklaces hanging on that. That's from one of my trips that I got that little hook thing there. Uh, you know I love nautical, so yeah. And then this thing is normally full of earrings, but I knocked it over and they fell on the ground and I gotta clean it up. And then that Eiffel Tower, you can't even tell because it's so covered in jewels. So uh, yeah, I always have to find ways of what to do with jewelry. Um, I have, I'll take you by Miss Bella. Hi, Miss Bella. So behind my door, sorry baby, gotta make you move, sorry. Um, this picture is an old picture I gotta get donated. But um, let me get you out of Zoom. Okay, so this is another thing I got really inexpensively. It just hangs like that and it just has that wood piece and the ropes and then another wood piece and that's how I hang a bunch of my bracelets and things. And as you can tell, this is when I was into my paparazzi phase because I could afford that at $5 a piece. But now I found Timu and you know, we don't have to pay no $5 on Timu. So <laughs> yeah, anyway, let me take you back over here. So this top is a definite two thumbs, two thumbs if I had them up. I love it. I love the material. Um, it fits nice. I mean, it's, you know, it's a little up there, but it's it, you can't feel it or anything. It's not uncomfortable whatsoever. I'm going to try and show you the back. I'm probably not going to be real successful. I got to figure out a setup for this. Um, you have some tips, let me know. But um, let me try this. It seems every time I do this, I end up not filming the mirror <laughs> so, because I can't see it. So, you know what? What if I put it on this? Okay, so ah, let's do. There we go. Okay, that kind of works, kinda. So anyway, so you see the design. Whoop whoop. The design on the back there with this opening. So it kind of just flaps open down there. So I just thought that's really cute. Um, this is my bra strap. So if you didn't have a bra on, all you would have would be that top um, line across and then nothing down the rest of it. So yeah, it's a really cute. So, oops, sorry. Um, so yeah, so this is a definite keeper. I hope you like it. Um, and again, any suggestions for what to do with these pants? Um, I'd love to hear it. So uh, yeah or any other kind of fashion tips you want to hand out to me that would be okay as long as we follow the number one most important rule in the world and that is be kind um i have had i have to compliment my subscribers and my viewers because i've only had probably shouldn't say it because i got knock on wood um one kind of mean comment the rest of you have been so nice um, like I said, my one viewer, Mimi, hi Mimi, um, kindly suggested, you know, oh, you know, you were complaining about your hair. Maybe if you cut it, um, it would look really cute and it's just an idea. And it, she just said it very nicely and politely. I took it to heart cause I was already thinking that way. And then I went that very day and chopped my hair off and I am happy. So um, yeah, so just be kind. That's all I ask for. <laughs> you know, I'm already unemployed. My poor little dog's got a limp. I'm having to walk without her. First world problems. <laughs> so so uh, I don't need mean, mean comments on top of, of, of everything else. And so yeah, keep your comments coming. I love them. Um, please do your, you know, thumbs up below. That helps me out with YouTube. Um, the like. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Come join us for the fun and um what's the other thing oh please share it share it on facebook share it wherever you can so that i can get more subscribers um i would love love especially right now um for this channel to get up high enough in youtube where i could start making a little change out of it um that i could then use to do more purchases on uh, timu and stuff and it it won't hurt me um or you know until i get a job i can use it to eat uh <laughs> you, you know i don't have a problem with that but anyway just kidding um and then also per a viewer's request i have added a buy me coffee button if that's something that you feel like doing um it's just a little you know way you can help out until i get monetized um and uh, like I said, the last 
amount that got donated by an awesome subscriber. I think her name is either Jane or Janelle. I can't tell by her handle. Um, but it went to buy Bella some great foods, um, some real foods that are healthy for dogs and good for them. And she is loving it. If you saw the video of her taking her dish out and licking every last drop out of it, she cracks me up. She did it again today. She's hysterical. Um, anyway, so um, that's that's my spiel. So yeah. Oh, and also for Timu, do not forget, use my link below in the description box. Um, it can get you goodies, but it also gets me something. I think I get five dollars if you use my link and place an order so please do that it doesn't cost you anything nothing changes for you other than helping me out um and then use my code i think it's afi something um but it's down below and um that will if you're a new user i've heard it will get you 50 percent off of your first order yeah um or um it also gets you a coupon bundle if you are a recurring purchaser so please use that link it helps me out again also um and then um what was the other thing i was gonna say oh i discovered i discovered that i signed on to the app on here using this phone number and so it's got me an account with this phone number and then on a different e and my email address and then on a different email address that i have I started getting Timu ads and when I clicked on it and I saw something, it was a great deal, so I purchased it, it actually didn't put it on this account, it gave me a new account. Wish I had figured that out sooner because I could have used a new user coupon on that order. So that's another, if you have multiple devices, um, try the multiple emails. I don't know if that really would have worked, I'm thinking it would have because now I have two accounts. Um, so yeah, try that. And then the other thing I've found is, and I'll try and remember to place it in the description box, is there's a Facebook group, uh, Timu Freebie Help or something like that, but I'll put it below. Um, but it's all users on there of Timu who play the games, the Fishland and the Farmland games. And I think they also do some other stuff on there. But anyway, um, if you invite them, to your farmland or fish land and they accept and you only get one per game per day but if they accept then they'll every time they go on there and feed their fish you get more fish so it helps both of you out you know and reciprocate don't just have somebody join you also join them um and then you can everybody puts like links or um, there are little code numbers in there. If you see a link, click on it and it'll tell you if you've used up your ability to get invites already that day or um, your clicks. If you've used them all up, you only get, you know, I think one or two clicks a day. I'm not sure how it all works, but I'm using them all. Um, but yeah, you can just click on their link and if that works, yay, you get more food or more water for your two games. Um, or they'll just put a code, a numeric code in there. And all you have to do is copy that little code and put it in the search bar in Timu. And then it'll take you to there, to the farmland or fishland, whichever it's, it's for. Um, and then it'll tell you if, if you have the ability to accept the extra food or water, or if you've already reached your limit. Anyway, just a tip I have. So, um, I'm so close to winning those games, but they keep, you know, you gotta feed more. Now it's like, 95.1 and then I feed it and it's 95.2 percent so it's it's a little frustrating but it takes me maybe five ten minutes every morning to play the game no big deal and I I've heard so many people on that Facebook group that have won so it is possible and I've seen youtubers that have won so it is possible just gets kind of annoying frustrating but whatever you just blow it off and go on with your day there's so many worse things than taking five or ten minutes to play a game um, to get some free gifts somewhere down the line <laughs> so anyway have a great day I'm gonna have a great day I'm going to the movies tonight it won't be the night you're seeing this but going tonight um and I'm gonna go out to dinner with my parents and we're gonna have a great time um hoping Bella gets better tomorrow or the next day or soon so I'm not walking by myself because I miss her she's my buddy um but anyway yeah have a great day I'm gonna have a great day Love you guys so much for watching, for commenting, for liking, for sharing, for putting up with me. Okay, guys, <laughs> comment below if you have any tips or anything for me. And just because I like to hear from you guys. And I do respond back. 
So, wah, thank you, thank you, thank you again. Love you. You make my day. Uh, you're making this unemployment thing so much more tolerable. So, uh, yeah, I'm not going crazy. I'm just hearing all the great wishes and everything, and something really good is on its way to me. I just got to be patient, and that's the hardest part. So, anyway, and cut your hair if you're thinking about it. It's so much cooler when it's 105 out, which it is. Uh, anyway, talk to you all later. Mwah. Bye.